GDP growth in China is likely to be, I would say, between 8.5 and 9% looking ahead. That's from a source, um, HSBC, uh, Standard Chartered, and even the state administration organization in China for foreign exchange. Uh, we're going to see an, probably an 8 to 9% growth rate. First time it's dropped beneath 9% since 2001, but it's still 8% growth, so we should be optimistic. We've had many success stories this year. Let's take Diageo. They were awarded the right to take over a Chinese uh, white uh, liquor company called Shui Jingfang in June of this year. That is a fantastic success, because if you recall, Coca-Cola failed to, to, to make a majority acquisition of a company. Secondly, Tesco, they've opened a 55,000 square meter logistics hub just outside Shanghai. Um, and J Jaguar Land Rover, JLR, they're likely to import 60,000 top of the range Land Rovers and sports cars from Wolverhampton and from the West Midlands. Um, and perhaps finally, Royal Sun Alliance, a uh, UK insurance company with an operation in China since the 1890s. They're the first insurer, not just British insurer, they're the first insurer to be able to set up a full operation in Nanjing, the capital of Jiangsu province, just outside Shanghai. So I think those are four really positive success stories that we should really tell the world about. Well, John will be visiting Beijing, Shanghai, uh, Shenzhen, and finally Hong Kong in a whistle-stop 72-hour tour. Um, we'll be engaging with the Chinese government in Beijing. We'll be meeting chief executives of Jaguar Land Rover and Intercontinental Hotels. Um, we will be hosted by the British ambassador as well uh, to a reception dinner, again in Beijing. Um, and more importantly, he'll be able to visit uh, the R&D facility of Huawei in Shenzhen. Uh, and finally, in Hong Kong, we will be meeting with senior executives of HSBC. These are some of the highlights that I think will make it a hopefully a memorable tour for John and certainly help us with our five years in, uh, in China and 500 member company sort of slogan for, for, for this year.